what is up guys so in this video i would like to talk about the reason why i have joined i recently joined boxing and i've also joined martial arts class that is specifically culinary so to start with let me just just say that i'm a person who has no idea no clue about this whole fighting atmosphere like i have no clue other than watching a couple of films right i have no experience with this and now all of a sudden i find myself amidst the hectic schedule of internship i find myself you know doing all this right and i do find great joy in this so this being an important part of my life i thought i'd just try to uh, get some insight to share with you so the first reason and probably the most important reason why i have joined this martial arts boxing is because you know life in internship you know the reality of it has just been this perpetual state of boredom right it has just been so redundant so recurrent i'm just doing the same things day in day out and it's it's not stimulating it's not stimulating my mind now i do understand that that is the reality of, of the situation i understand that that is the work that i have to do not just me all the interns and i do it right we all do it sincerely but still but still at the end of the day it feels like i'm longing for something i'm i'm longing for something something other than this is what i'm longing for and i don't know what like i sincerely don't know what but there is something that is missing so to fill this void of my life <laughs> right is what i have i've i've tried filling this with a lot of other things nothing has worked so boxing and martial arts has kind of been helping me to fill this void you know there's a saying that i like and it goes something like this you know either you have to be earning or you have to be learning if it is none of those things then it's like it's sad right and i think that is what is happening right now right at this point of time i'm not learning much right uh, and i'm not earning at all so yeah maybe that's uh, that's the reason why i have found, found myself uh, in this situation and also the thing is i am like an introvert person right so what i mean is that the work that i do has a lot of implication uh, in my in my satisfaction right i could just i could be doing something that i really like and i do not need anything else you know back in the days i used to play video games from 8 o'clock to 4 o'clock like that's the only thing i did right and i i did that for one month consecutively without talking to anyone without doing anything i just played video games why because i loved the because i liked the aspect because i liked video games and i was like in my own world with regards to video games you know battlefield modern warfare fifa and that is you know it is it is my nature to find something and just keep doing it and i don't have a care in the world about anything else and because i give great importance to the work that i'm doing if i don't i'm doing something that i do not particularly enjoy <laughs> you know it's only it's only sad that you know i become you know kind of kind of sad so moving on to the next point and that is uh, reason number 2 is i do not know how to fight <laughs> right i know this is obvious right but then nevertheless it's it's an important point like i do not know how to fight like if i were to be put in a situation where i must fight right i might fight but i am going to get my ass beat like i am going to lose for sure right i don't necessarily believe that you know you have to fight and you have to destroy someone you know that's not uh, that's not my way of thinking unless it is in in a controlled environment let's say for ufc or some fighting competition something like that but if i were to put, be in a street fight or something like that right in a impromptu situation i think it is important to defend yourself i wish i was joking but you know this profession you know it's kind of you know you never know what's going to happen right there are situations multiple situations where you know fights have broken out you know people just coming at you for example let's say someone dies and you know people get emotioned and that can lead uh, to such fights happening right so it's so it's important to defend myself and so that is one way of of thinking one way to put it but nevertheless at the end of the day i do not know how to fight even though i want to fight even though i want to defend myself i don't know how to fight and what i believe in in terms of fighting i just want to be able to defend myself and just get out as soon as possible kind of like trying to de escalate the whole situation calm down the whole situation and just neutralize the target right <laughs> and just get out i think that is the most crucial part uh, in terms of uh, fighting and defending there is a saying which i really like and that is it is better to be a warrior in a garden than a gardener in war so in life most of the times you know nothing's going to happen but it is very important that we are equipped to face any situation that may that may come our way so that's a saying which i like and nextly there is this whole aspect of learning something new let's say you are in first year and then now you go into second year 
right? After learning all the three subjects, now you go to second year and you start learning the new subjects, right? Pathology, pharmacology, all these new subjects. And there is this, this sense of wow, this wow factor when you are starting to learn something new. Uh, that, that's, that feeling is uh, it's kind of amazing, right? You're learning something new. You're learning a whole new thing, that, that, new, that new feeling, that, that ingenuity, you know? I hope ingenuity is the correct word. <laughs> I don't even know what that means. Anyways, so that new feeling uh, is, is really amazing. You know, it's, it gives you this wow factor. It's like, wow, you know, that's, that's nice. And in my childhood, unfortunately, you know, I don't think I've spent a lot of time learning something new. You know, I have this neighbor, right? She's like, I don't know, eight years old or something. The other day I was asking, you know, what are you up to? Like, how's it going? And then she was like, you know, I'm kind of busy. I'm really busy. And this, this, is, a, this is an eight-year-old <laughs> and she's saying she's busy. And I was like, I'm confused. Like, what is, what is she busy with? Right? And then she was like, I have drawing class, I have painting class, I have dancing class, and a bunch of things. Like she was engaged for the whole week except for uh, Sunday or Saturday, something like that. Oh, no, no, Saturday she had a dancing class. So she was engaged uh, for the whole week, right? So it got me thinking, like, what did I do when I was little? All I, all I did was play video games, and I played football, maybe hung, out, hung around with friends, but as such, in terms of learning something new of value, that will, that will help me for the rest of my life. I don't think I've spent enough time doing that. Just played video games. That's, that's all I did. And you know, no one taught me all this. No one told me I have to do this. You know, my parents are doctors, and uh, you know they already have a lot on their plate. Right, they're too busy with their own lives, and right, no, there's no one to tell me, like, tell me all this. Right, it's, it's unfortunate, but it is what it is. The the best time to do all this was years ago. Right, it was years ago, but. The second best time is now. And that's how I got myself in this situation. So I'm just doing what feels right right now. And, you know, I feel good. So far, it's been going great. And last but not least, you know, I have my friends. I have my co-warriors. <laughs> right? I have people uh, who I go to the gym with, who I go to the uh, boxing class with. So it's really fun with them. When I feel down, I can just look at him and he's going hard. Like he's doing something. So I'll be motivated. And the same thing goes for him. And it's kind of, we can motivate each other, right? We can stay accountable for each other. And that's a whole amazing different aspect of, of going, to the, going to the class with my friends. Of course, there can be other reasons, but these are the reasons that are, that are true to me. And that is what I want to share with you guys. So hope you guys enjoyed this video. I will see you in the next one. Peace.